Figūros ir kampai. Figūros ir kampai. Let's start from the adjective round. Apskritas. 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 Or a synonym apvalus. 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 These are both adjectives meaning round. And the shape circle is apskritimas. 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 You see that there is up in all these words. It may be a prefix. Perhaps it was a prefix. And it was made from some other words with the help of this up prefix. But uh, it's hard to tell nowadays since there are no words without with these roots uh, there are no other words now so perhaps these words were made with the help of this up prefix and it will help you remember if you remember that the both adjectives meaning round and the noun meaning circle have up in the front of those words so this is this may be a prefix now let's uh, Let's just uh, take a note about the words for these shapes. You know, compass means angle, compass. And when there is a word made from two roots, like from the word three and angle, like in the English, like in English, triangle, the ending of the second word changes to is is so see all words made from two words have the have the ending is now a note about the stress if you are talking about the shape you want to say triangle you put the stress on the on the last vowel of the first root and if you are talking about if you're say, if you're saying adjective like a, uh, a triangle sofa perhaps or a, a rectangle a rectangular a playground mm, you put the stress on um um so let's just say these words and uh, I'll just say these words and you'll notice the stress so I'll just say the nouns the names of the shapes trikampis 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 keturkampis 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 penkakampis 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 sheshakampis 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 ashtuniakampis 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 you, you see the stress is mostly on the uh, at the end of the first root tre tre campus ketur campus penka campus shesha campus only ashtonia campus for ashtonia campus the stress is on m and octagon but if you want to say the adjective like a triangular a rectangular and so on you say tre campus ketur campus Penke campus, sheshe campus, ashtune campus. But you know, the stress, putting the stress is a thing that's, you know, it's a law that's broken by the speakers of the language. And if you say tricampus uh, uh, for the shape and for the adjective, uh, you will be understood. So mostly you can say all these shapes this way. Tricampus, campus. Penke campus, sheshe campus, ashtune campus. You can say this way and you will be understood. But you know, the high requirements for, for the stress, since there are rules for stressing words and so on, the actual uh, correct stress should be put uh, at the end of the first word if you're talking about the shape, ketur campus. But uh, I noticed that not many people say ketur campus mostly say ketur campus on the uh, when they want to say rectangle a rectangle 
when when they want to say a shape. So let's just say this way: three campus, four campus, five campus, six campus, or twenty campus. Yeah, because you can easily get confused with the stress, and you will be perfectly understood if you said everything, all those shapes, this way. So that's it about the stress. Maybe that was this was too long. This explanation was too long and unnecessary, but I just wanted you to know about the correct stress requirements. So these three other shapes is, are rhombus, 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 ligia gratainis, ligia gratainis, ligia gratainis, trapezia, trapezia, trapezia. You see, this is a suffix ein, just like in the word uh, hamburger, measainis. Hamburger is made from the words measa and the suffix ein. So you get measainis. And just like this, you have ligia gratus. Ligia gratus means uh, parallel. And uh, the adjective parallel and ein because these are two parallel lines and these are two parallel lines so you get this shape Ligia Gratinus now let's see the lines angles and shapes Linios compare figuras well there are no shapes in this this slide but the next slide will show you some uh, some other shapes so this is linea Linea or tiesia, tiesia, tiesia. So tiesia is made from the word tiesus. Uh, tiesus is straight. Now these two parallel lines, ligia gratus, ligia gratus, ligia grete, ligia gratus, ligia grete, because ligus means equal. And greta means next to or close to. Greta means close to something. Like, istovi greta manas. He's standing close to me. Greta. And ligus is equal. Greta means close to. So it's 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 uh, the word for the word parallel. Ligi gracios tiesis. Ligi gracios tiesis. Parallel lines, parallel lines, ligia gracios tiesis. From this word, another noun, ligia gratinus is formed. Just in the previous slide, the shape ligia gratinus is made from these, from these adjectives. Now, a perpendicular angle, status compass, status compass, status compass. It's normal adjective, so if you want to say uh, the feminine word of this, the fem feminine form of this adjective, you have to say state, state. The plural masculine would be status, and the plural feminine would be status. So perpendicular is status or state. If you're talking about something, um, about some noun, about some feminine noun. Okay, now. Smailus compass. Smailus compass. Smailus compass. This angle. Bukas compass. Bukas compass. Bukas compass. So this is a sharp angle, and this angle is bukas. I don't remember the word in English actually. But this angle. Bukas. No, it's more than 180 degrees, and this is. I'm sorry, this is uh, more than 90 degrees. Bukas, more than 90 degrees, more than pe uh, perpendicular. And this is less than 90 degrees. So, smilos, bukas. Now, erdves figuros. Erdves figuros. These are the shapes, spatial shapes, or 3D shapes. Erdve means space. So, this is rutulis, 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 or sfera, 
Sfera. Sfera. Rutulis or Sfera. Kubas. 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 Stacia Campus Greta Sienis. Now, where is this word from? Such a compass is a rectangle. And Greta Sienis, Greta means close to, and Sienos means walls. So, this is a rectangle uh, with whose walls are close to somehow. Or, you know, such a compass Greta Sienis. Such a compass Greta Sienis. Or the correct stress is stachacampus, but you know, mostly, in most cases, people don't say stachacampus, they say stachacampus. Stachacampus gratisienus, stachacampus gratisienus. Okay, pyramidia, pyramidia, pyramidia. Kugis, kugis, cylindras, cylindras, retinis, retinis. Retinis is made from the word. Ristis. Ristis ritis ritosi. A reflexive verb which means to roll. Like, no, ristis no kalno. To roll from the mountain. Just like, you know, something is rolling down. Riste, ritinis. Rutulis is a sphere. Kubas cube. A rectangle. Uh, a rectangle. pyramid, a cone, and a cylinder. So these were the main shapes.